so happy. There you go. I just did the jump thing and you can see my stacks have gone. <laughs> Hello everybody, it's your boy N here. I'm coming at you guys with another video and as you can tell I am excited AF for today's video because this is truly game changing for anyone who uses Bunny. So without further ado guys, let's get right on into today's video. Before we do that though real quick, my creator code is going to be on screen right now and my discord server is going to be linked in the description. As of right now, I am doing a giveaway of 2750 caliber in my discord server, so make sure to join and get in up on that giveaway. Now with all of this out of the way, let's actually talk about what's gone on and why this is so insane for bunny players. So the narcissism module has actually been fixed. So what this is is whilst you're sprinting your skill cost and your skill cooldown go down when you use this and you stack it up to 10 times. Now previously in the past this module was a little bit different. If you tripped on a rock, hit a wall or did anything this module would lose its stacks and you would be forced to build your uh, stacks up again in order to get yourself the extra cooldown and to get yourself uh, the negative skill cost as well. Now as you can see from this gameplay on screen this is an entire run of Magister Lab on public and you can see my MP is literally stuck at max MP. So the way that this module has been fixed, let's talk about it a little bit more in depth. But before we do that, I'm going to give you the config that I'm running inside of this video specifically, just so we're all on the same page here. So this is the bunny config that I am rocking as of right now. So I'm using high voltage to do more damage with less tendrils, but more damage overall. Now the key mod here is going to be narcissism. The module that has been fixed that is 100% going to change this game. Next up we have increased HP for a little bit of survivability, focus on electric, and then we've got skill expansion. This is for more electrical damage, this is for more range, again maximize range, even more range with the bunny, multi-talented, so when we are using the singular abilities, as you can see at the bottom, all attribute damage is plus 30 for 5 seconds. Then we are using focus on singular because bunny's abilities are singular and the third ability is singular which is the important one and then skill concentration for extra crit damage, uh, strong mentality for a little bit of negative skill cost, maximize conservation for skill cost and I prefer to use long distance maneuvering but this is all completely optional, uh, the maneuvering mod doesn't make a difference just rock whatever you prefer. Now this is the build I am using for this gameplay. Now let's talk about the reactor. So for the reactor, you can run any stats on this reactor at all. As you can see, I'm running Bunny with a toxic reactor. That just goes to show you can run whatever you want. However, there is one important thing that you need on this reactor and that is going to be skill cost. So for skill cost, it's either going to be purple or gold you're going to want. It may work with blue, but I would recommend farming a purple or a gold out. Now for the set, I would highly recommend rocking the supernova set. Over here, I'm just running random parts from every single set just because I need the MP recovery modifier and I need MP recovery in combat. As long as you have that on the sensor and on the memory you're basically good to go. However for optimal levels of damage you're definitely going to want to get the MP recovery in combat and the MP recovery modifier on supernova parts because as you see here if you're running a full supernova set it is basically a key to buffing bunny's damage. Okay, so with Bunny, the way narcissism has been fixed is once you build it up, once you get yourself up to your stacks or whatever, you can run into the wall, you can stop running as long as you are using a bunny second ability your narcissism will not run out and with the way that i've built my config you can see i've basically got unlimited sprinting anyways so you can literally infinite stand into a wall with this you can infinitely jump with this config and it is going to work and you're gonna get extra damage output now narcissism still stops if you use a grapple or in this instance now when you start shooting your gun narcissism will also drop the combo multiplier however if you just use your second ability and you just keep moving you are basically good for literally infinite bunny sprinting as you can see off the mp bar right over there now this module has now made it again so that you are indeed able to stop running hit walls trip over rocks all that sort of stuff and your recovery is not going to drop you are now have access to literally infinite sprinting along with infinite mp and infinite use of your third ability with bunny which is just absolutely insane. 
So what does this actually mean for Bunny though? So already Bunny was the best for farming in this game. Now whilst farming for Bunny, or with Bunny at least, you have infinite MP, infinite recovery. Now you can also use your third ability infinitely. If you get the correct reactor and the correct set to go along with this, your damage output will be significantly higher and that just goes to mean that Bunny is going to be the best, best, best option going forward as if she wasn't already. On top of that, Nexon, I did not see none of this in the patch notes. You shadow fixing Bunny is insane. I appreciate it so much though, as do the rest of the community because now Bunny is even, even more broken, which is exactly what we needed. But Bunny mains rise up. Bunny fanatics aside, this means that this module is no longer memed on as someone really really nicely pointed out in my comment section. This module is now probably if not 100% the best choice. As you can see there again, I ran into the enemies, there's my stacks dropping, no they ain't bro, I can't believe this. I've been waiting for this day for so long bruh. Thank you Nexon, I appreciate this so much. Anyway guys, that's basically been this video and I hope you have enjoyed. If you did, please do smash that like button. If you're going to be dropping this on Bunny, let me know. Because I'm so hyped about this and this just means Bunny is that that much more amazing. Also, PS, the new Bunny skin and the new uh, spawn animation are absolutely fire. I bought both of them immediately. Next on, you have won my heart over. Right, that's been this video. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please do smash that like button. And if you are new here, please do drop a like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace!